Hey there everybody, this is Rai, and welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft Temple of the Gods. We are going to be going through the Labyrinth of blah blah blah. No, no. The Labyrinth of Kepri. I don't know how to pronounce words. If you know me by now, you should know that trying to get me to speak English is next to impossible. Are you lost? Fuck you, buddy. I have an... Um oh. There we go. Um, how simple. I am not lost. I have happen to have a great sense of direction. In the, within the confines of my own mind, maybe. Just making sure that I don't miss any more treasure. Because God forbid, I don't want to miss any treasure. Let me out of here! Oh, there's the path out, but let me go this way, because there was that little sign over there that said there could be more than one piece of gold in each room. And there we go, we have two more. Okay, we are on the right track. We're on the road again. We are totally on the road again, and oh my god, there's lag! My game froze! Oh, here we go! The Mystery of Tefnut. And there, I thought it was the Mystery of Chestnut. I've been playing too much Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Get my team up to snuff. Every item in a box is there for a reason. No, you're not. You're lying. A brick. Oh, God. I've, I've never used bricks before, to be entirely honest with you guys. What the hell does that do? doesn't open the door. Huh. Let's think about this for a second. No other switches. Every item can be used for a reason. see the reason as to why I would need a brick here of all places. There's no other switches. everything possible. Huh. Every item in a box is there for a reason. And then you give me a switch that doesn't really do anything. Is there something here that I missed? Is there like a secret door or something? I have no clue. No clue whatsoever. I don't... I don't want to go back. Huh. I told you guys, I'm not good at puzzle solving. Why, why I do these, I have no clue, but... Maybe just to showcase my stupidity. Yeah, I'm going to go with that for $500, Regis. I can't... I don't even know what brick is normally used for, except by making... brick stones and all that. Okay, be right back. Okay, like I was supposed to know this, but, you know, my IQ is about as proficient as a mouse's. Uh, 
Really, I did not know that would work. Um, a fishing rod. Yeah, I looked at a video that was on the official, well, the official page of this, um, this custom map, this custom adventure. I've never, I never used a fishing, fishing rod before. But yeah, no shame in doing that. I this is my very first one of my very first puzzlers per se with um shit. Sad thing is I'm using up the um See, there has to be a switch. Am I doing something wrong? There's a leather lever in there. Can I get the leather? I'm saying leather when I should be saying lever. Huh. Aha! I'm I supposed to crouch. Um, find the correct order. Oops. Um. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the tail. I am very immature, so I will pick this one for sure. First try, what the hell? Oh god, there's a lot of pressure plates in here. Uh... Simple enough. Let me put this away, just in case I need to use it in the future. The secret of Seshat. Seshash. Wooden planks. Let me put them right here and ladders. Hmm. Sure, there's no like super secret pressure plate or whatever, even though. Huh. What am I supposed to do here with wooden planks and ladders? Ladders I would need to use to climb. There's no point in just building building the wooden planks onto these, right? Yeah, I thought so. Thankfully I can break these down into wooden blocks again, but... Something... Huh. Very perplexed. I mean, f from the look of this, you would think that, you know, you're supposed to rebuild a pillar or something. I'm just gonna keep trying that with each and every one. I don't know, it's a long shot, but it's the only shot I have. I swear to God, I, heard, I just heard something. Hmm. Why 
one, two, three, four, five. The switches aren't secret levers. Why do I... What the hell? I didn't mean to do that. I keep saying leather instead of lever. Even... Oops! Sorry. I swear to God that was not a mistake. Um... Hey, accidents happen. I don't even think that's in the right place. I think it's supposed to be right there, but hopefully that doesn't really matter. What can I do with three of these? It's not like I can use the fishing rod. I'm gonna need the ladders for something. I could make sticks, but I'm not supposed to craft anything unless I'm supposed to, right? I'll be back. Uh, crap. I'm seriously at a loss for words. I was actually double checking on the rules to see if I could break anything or create anything because I could, you know, make know sticks but I just realized that I can't no crafting whatsoever and it says in the rules so huh well I wouldn't be given ladders you know just to you know have ladders I'd have to climb something and there's nothing to climb and I assumed I was supposed to make some sort of pillar or whatever but um let's think about this for a second the secret the idea, it's a secret. If you want to have a secret, you'd want to hide something, right? I think I might need to destroy something because these are the only blocks in this room. So if this is a room about a secret, wouldn't it be hiding behind a block or something? Let's try. Oh. Well, there was apparently sand. Uh, stay up. I've learned something from my Minecraft adventures, my normal Minecraft adventures. If you dig straight up, when you know that there's pretty much a desert right above you, you're going to get squished if you end up hitting sand on top. Oh, here we go. Because that's what happened to me. I'm, let's see. Yeah. Uh, duh. Do, do, do. Yeah, I got ended up getting squished and lost my diamond pickaxe, some iron and all that. Really disheartening. Let's see. Three minecarts. Why would I need so many minecarts? The Gap of Anubis. Prepare for a ride to hell. Oh, God. Please tell me if this isn't like a quick time event or something. Uh, let's get the other minecarts ready just in case. And be ready for next time on Let's Play Minecraft Temple of the Gods. I'm Rizaiken, obviously the most stupid puzzle solver in the history of puzzle solving. And we will crack and find out the truth to this temple next time. Happy gaming!